you cannot put freight on a subway. You know, trucks are coming in. Kendra Hems, the president of the Trucking Association of New York, says there's no doubt about it. Congestion pricing will mean it will cost you more to buy everything from milk to flowers. We deliver over 90% of the freight in New York City. Delivery trucks did not get an exemption in the final vote of congestion pricing. Trucking companies will be paying $24 to $36 every time they make a delivery south of 60th Street in Manhattan. It'll likely hit both customers in the zone and potentially customers outside of the zone as they just spread it out across their freight rates. The MTA says 90% of New Yorkers uh, come by transit. And you know, one of the biggest goals of this whole exercise is to finally attack congestion. But the other side of the equation is to invest more in transit. Exemptions went to emergency vehicles, disabled New Yorkers, school buses, and public commuter buses like Coach USA, Hampton Jitney, and Munsey Trails. Patrick Condren with the Bus 4 NYC says bus commuters should not have had to pay. We're part of the New York Metropolitan Transportation System, and we remain so. But Stephen Traub, the owner of the Wall Street Grill, says bus exemptions won't help him stay open in lower Manhattan. 95% of my customers right now are driving in from outside New York. It's very easy to just go somewhere in Brooklyn, somewhere in New Jersey, somewhere else, rather than patronize a restaurant in the zone.